all right hello guys and welcome we have another one but this one is urgent we need to fix it in a half an hour the customer is waiting in a coffee shop nearby so we have to figure it out quickly so what's wrong with it Oof. well That's one thing that could be wrong with it. It's completely clogged. Oh wow. Let me blow it out. And this one could be actually an easy fix. Hopefully. It does turn on. But no picture. You see the LED is on. The fan is on. Maybe, hopefully, a frozen bias. Hmm. That would be nice, right? Yeah. A Lenovo plug. Let's see what it's doing current-wise. This one? No, that's too big. This? Too small. This one, for sure. Yeah. Oh, we have... 20 volts, 1 amp, uh, first channel, current 3 amps, power on the channel, let's see what's, what's it doing, immediately 1 amp, that's fine, we have the orange light here, so it is charging, it seems, right, we are charging, right, it could be a bias issue, could be. Yeah, let's reset the BIOS. Disconnect the battery somehow. <laughs> I should just take it out. Yes, the battery is out. Jeez, BIOS battery is out. Shorting the thing. And does it matter if you short this? Don't think so, but I'm doing it anyways. Okay. Plug it in. It should start auto magically. It did. And we wait for a picture. Come on. Give me a picture, give me my pizza and uh, call it a day. Did it restart? I didn't pay attention. No. The fan is spinning. The CPU is warm. No. It could be the memory though. Huh? Could be. Mm, yeah, it's not gonna do it. I mean, it's kind of stuck. The current, you know, 815, 816, it doesn't move. have a blinking light didn't see that before so what does it say one okay it's hard to see sorry okay let's see what's doing one yeah wait it's blinking all the time could be the memory let's let's swap the memory well, this one should be fine. How about now? No, oh, look, it's blinking. Why is that? Because no battery? Uh, I don't think so. I don't think so. Power on the battery. Well, now it's coming on. It's not blinking anymore. Okay. I'm watching the light here. It is on. The fan stopped and went again. Yeah, but the current is too still. Nothing. Can we turn it off?
Yeah, but kind of kind of saw the backlight. Let me connect it to the TV. Nothing. Voltages. There's the battery here. One seven. One point two. One seven. One seven. Everything is one seven. Five volts. This is three. That looks fine, but no picture. It can be the BIOS. Does it have the onboard RAM? It does. That's bad. There can be your issue. Ha! Ah, so let's find the BIOS for it and flash the BIOS. Gosh darn it. 25Q128. JVSO this one where is the input voltage it's not here yeah 27 to 3.6 okay and let me try to find the bias file and M C seven one one. Okay, pin one is here. Like this. Software is here. Detect I C. J V. Yeah, select that. Read. This is gonna take a while. Right, this is, is success. Let's verify it. Verify IC. So if that goes well, well, I'm gonna do it one more time. Read and verify. And then I'm gonna write the BIOS file I found and see if we have any difference. File save. Original two and compare with original two and we don't want any of this. Compare identical. That's that's good. Open and now we want this open compare. Well Okay, well, let's, so let's try. Open this and do all of that. Yes. All right. It took three minutes to erase and five minutes to program. Insane. Okay. I mean, we test. I'm not giving it high hopes, but we can try. Charger. We have a charging light. Power on. It is coming on. Now it's the same, huh? Yeah, power button is working. Yeah, it is. Okay, let's press the chips in one by one and start. Memory chips, that is. Well, that's different. Oh, it's doing something now.
Did we have a flash of something? Yeah, the backlight is on. Yeah. So look what I did. I just press with my thumb on the memory chips here and it's working. So what do you say about that, huh? Yeah, it's dead now. So it's the memory. Uh, so I need to disable the onboard RAM. Let's do a request on the forum, on the Discord. Jump to present. And let's do, yeah, request disable on board RAM. If possible, check if BIOS is okay. Thanks. Yeah, that. And upload the file. Uh, Lenovo original one open. Yeah, and post, right? Yeah, we did that. Now we wait. I don't have a PC ready for the disabling the RAM because that software has some kind of virus or something. It's the next day. Didn't get any help from the Discord, sadly. So we are going to use this Lenovo to try to mess with the BIOS file and turn off the onboard RAM. I had my drive in my hand. This? No. This? No. This? No. Yeah. God damn it. Ah, you need to drag. Yeah, okay. You take the thingy. Right. Error. So disable all of it, huh? Zap, zap, zap. DDR4. Pfft. I don't know. Okay. Yeah, whatever. So we have this. Uh, Org RAM disable this tablet. Yeah, and we put it here. Right. That's that. It is done programming. Let's see if it works. Uh, we have our plug. Let's see. Plug it in. Yeah, it's the same. No? Yeah, it should work. Uh, the current is jumping around. Huh? Come picture. Wiggling it around. Yes. Ha <laughs> guys, memory and all you need to do is disable it.
And yeah, it's working. Yeah, touching the memory a bit. It's not freezing up. Fantastic, guys. And yeah, we only have 4 gigs of RAM, but you know, it's working. Wow, huh? Fixed another one. Unbelievable. So yeah, guys, if you like this, hit the like button. If you didn't hit the dislike button, consider subscribing. It helps a lot. You also have some links down there if you want a tweezer or a solder wire or any tool that I use here in my shop, you can check it out. I do the get a small commission and that helps a lot also. So yeah, thank you guys a lot and you know, see you in the next one. Bye.